it's Jade Bolden and welcome to our wellness product class number three and we today we're going to talk about maintaining healthy weight how to maintain lifelong healthy weight you know that's the question right some of us you know we think if we go on a diet and we eat a certain thing way for a certain amount of time then we lose the weight but hey you know what it's going to come back again if we don't keep this lifestyle so we want to tell you about how to do this in an effective way that will help you have permanent healthy weight okay it's going to be awesome so we are going to talk about the mind the body and the spirit cleansing restoring okay that was our last class if you didn't watch that go back to the last class and um, understand that we we'll talk about the slim and sassy oil and metabolism and we'll introduce a few supportive tools all right okay so if you don't have this already go to jadebolden.com and download this this is the sheet um, that we follow when we teach this class um, you know if you are a teacher and you're teaching this locally just give people a pack like this and um, you know they can follow along and go home and to share with their family and review because this is what um, you know this is basically the the gist of the class all right so let's start with the first one the mind um, and the next one we'll talk about the body we'll talk about the metabolic bombs and the metabolic boosters things that will help you metabolize well all right so let's start with the first part and um, if you look here we'll always start with the mind and the spirit because then you know that is the foundation of everything right um, so we need to work on self-love first okay so having the self-love means you are enough because you are divine you have a divine heritage you are a child of God and you don't have to measure yourself against anything out there um, you are enough so when you feel like you are enough you stop abusing yourself so you stop um, eating the junk you actually stop um, saying mean things about yourself because when people have self abuse they allow a lot of fungus to to attack their body they just allow lots of things ha to happen so um, weight just starts with the mind okay and feeling safe and loved and protected by the divine okay so that's where we start so work on that first alrighty and then we develop a healthy belief that a healthy weight is your body's natural and balanced state so don't buy into the I've got fat genes or whatever it is that we believe or I don't know genetically I'm like this and I can't help it um, you know what we're you know in the past when you look at those old movies and stuff everybody's that size you know they're healthy um, and you know look at the whole civilizations sometimes some of the cultures that all of them are actually roughly that healthy size so that's actually our healthy uh, state our body actually knows to go back there um, so if we eliminate toxins and help the cells communicate with each other properly that's where our cells are going to go that's where our bodies are going to go okay so that's our, our natural state um, and we need to also understand to reduce stress and play because um, stress is not going to allow us to release a lot of the fat or, and uh, excess weight okay so you know get somebody to give you a massage even if it's like you know 10 minutes a day it's something so teach your spouse you know do a swapsies <laughs> okay um, but and I, I just put that picture of that lady it's so liberating it's so free to understand that this is who you really are you're this healthy person inside all right so when I first had kids somebody told me that oh get used to um, you know being this size because you're gonna you know explode and be you know be fat and ugly and uh, you know it just was very miserable because I feel like wait I don't have control over that but really at the end of the day when I figured it out we do and we can have this awesome healthy body to 
um, experience this um, earthly experience with. So, you know, work on the mind and the spirit first, okay, guys? Okay, the next thing here is we're going to talk about the body. So, last class is about 30 day cleansing, cleaning out the cells, because you know that healthy cells make healthy tissues, healthy tissues make healthy organs, and healthy organs make a healthy body. Mm -hmm. So it's very important that we understand we need to keep our cells all clean. And when our cells are cleansed, sometimes during that process, we do a little bit of emotional cleansing too. So if people get a little bit irritated and anxious, that's okay, it's normal. Make sure you don't make big major decisions while you're detoxing because that's not really you talking. It's just all the pent up emotions that you've suppressed all these years. It's coming up. Okay, so remember that and remind each other. Okay, the other thing is about sleeping and resting. We'll talk about all that as we go. All right, but the 30 take cleanse, remember to use your supplements and um, your enzymes and your zendocrine. Okay, those are important. All right, um, and uh, even after the cleanse, we just keep using the products. We may not use the GX Assist or the PV Assist um, as often, but uh, we actually keep maintaining our organs. So you know that's that's how we um, we do it. My family, at least, and um, all the people that we've taught to do that. So remember the cleanse. That's the thirty day. Um, we have the first 10 days just prepping the body with nutrients and then we have the GX assist in the middle, the middle 10, then we have the last 10 days we do the uh, probiotics, okay, to re-establish the healthy shield to um, protect us and to help break down foods, okay. So the other thing on that list was sleep, sleep you can lose weight in your sleep, guys. So remember that. So what happens when we sleep? Let's read this. So um, our brain is processing information. We process emotions. We develop memories. Our brain regulates growth and repair. Uh, we replace energy reserves, okay? Uh, and um, our body starts removing waste. Even our brain starts flushing through. We have this brain lymphatic fluid like thing that just flushes through our brains our brain shrinks a little bit at night and we rebuild metabolism we want our bodies to work with us not against us so our body actually helps with metabolism so we're going to burn more um, than we normally would okay if we have had enough sleep um, so if we don't get enough sleep you know we have lots of health problems so we lose attention uh, we actually have high levels of micro sleep, which is bad because we can get into accidents and things. Um, you know, we can't process information very well. We are impulsive. We lose empathy. We just can't get other people because, you know, you know, you can see that when people don't have enough sleep and rest, they, they are very um, snappy um, and it impairs memory, uh, reduces cognition and creativity. Um, it suppresses the immune system, high risk of infection, cancer, cardiovascular disease, diabetes, um, and mental and metabolic syndromes, mood instability. We start getting anxious, and um, you know, long term, you might have you know, other problems. Um, so it will increase the use of stimulants and sedative, and um, you know, might lead to some mental health concerns. So basically get a lot of sleep. Okay, that's part of weight management. Ah, okay, so we have some amazing oils that we have to use for um, weight. And I'll go through this and I'll go through this again in the next class too. Balance oil across your forehead, on your ears, the back of your neck, on the big toes to help with the mind chatter. So a lot of us have monkey brains and we just buzz, 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 think, 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 think. And this says, stop thinking, switch off, go to sleep. And you can use it again in the morning to say, hey, one thing at a time. Don't, you know, go all crazy all over the place. Amazing. So balance is the grounding blend. Lavender is just calming and relaxing. So if you have a, a you know, hard time relaxing, that's the oil I would use. Vetiver helps you 
feel more grounded put that on the bottom of your feet put it on your ears across your forehead if you want to juniper berry is the oil that keeps you asleep so if you wake up at three o'clock every morning to go to the bathroom or whatever it is then you want to use juniper berry put it under your tongue or you can do you can rub it on your tummy too you could do both um, up to you but this helps with the organs and helps it go to sleep Okay, helps calm the organs at night time. Serenity is amazing oil and serenity comes in a soft gel as well. And the soft gel has um, a few extra things to help us sleep and it's all natural and it's not habit forming. That's the exciting part of it. All right, so get enough sleep, get yourself that all that sleep and then hey, you know what, weight management will be so much easier. All right. Okay, so the other thing we want to do is manage hormones. So when we're cleansing, we're actually cleansing the xenoestrogens, the bad estrogens, the synthetic estrogens out of our cells, which is great because then our cells will help balance. But uh, if you um, feel like you need more help, we have the women's health kit here that will help balance hormones. Because even problems like diabetes and things, that's a metabolic um, concern but you need um, the hormones to produce the, um, the chemicals for metabolism. So that's balancing hormones. So it goes all the way back to balancing hormones there. Okay, so that's that. And we'll talk about that in our next class too. Um, but I just wanted to touch on it a little bit now. And of course, the Slim and Sassy blend, which is this here. Okay, Slim and Sassy helps manage appetite, um, helps with energy, uh, helps metabolize fat and helps with insulin. Amazing. Okay, so the ingredients is um, our peppermint, uh, we have grapefruit, ginger, which is awesome. Um, we have cinnamon, okay, great for the insulin, um, ginger is too, by the way, and lemon oil. Okay, so all of that's so fantastic. What a wonderful blend that is for our body. Um, with the Slim and Sassy, you can put a few drops in water. You can actually put it in your water bottle. Um, <laughs> I just realized my water bottle is green. Um, <laughs> and you can put a few drops in that glass and drink that. Okay, and uh, you just have... Um, Slim and Sassy soft gels that you can take and you can actually rub um, Slim and Sassy on your tummy if you like as well. Okay, so that's the other thing. <laughs> um, it helps with cholesterol, helps the digestion, it helps with, um, with inflammation. So it's a wonderful, wonderful oil blend. Okay, that will really help us. Now, next thing on our list we want to talk about are the um, metabolic bombs things that slow down your metabolism because you want your metabolism to be revved up so that you're burning more fat at rest um, okay so bad oils canola oil bad um, vegetable oil bad hydrogenated oils bad all of those oils are like eating plastic so your body can't break it down it has to store it somewhere okay and it's just going to clog up your arteries and all sorts of bad things so don't do that to yourself um, eat good oils, okay, like um, virgin olive oil, coconut oil, things like that. That's that's unrefined, okay. The, the main idea is that it's unrefined because your body knows what to do with it because it's all the, the chemical structure that is found in nature, has, as it is found in nature, is still, is still intact. So your body can know what to do with it. When it's um, ripped apart and it's changed in, in a very significant way your body can't recognize it doesn't know what to do with it it's unstable in your body okay so eat it and use it like it was you know found in nature that's the idea even sugar a lot of sugar is bad of course but there's some sugars that um, are raw you know in its raw form and it's like the antidote to it okay and it actually helps you with your insulin so nature right um, Low quality carbs, yep, don't take that because that lowers your metabolism. Skipping meals, like getting yourself very hungry, your body starts to pre, uh, reserve some fat because it's thinking that it's starving. Um, inflammatory foods, of course, because it's going to hurt your organs. 
um, refined sugars. Like I said, it's not in the complete structure as found in nature. So your body will have a hard time balancing it. It's going to spike your body unnecessarily. Spike the insulin levels, I mean. Okay, and of course you already know the rest and no, um, no rest and stress because that will trigger cortisol, which is a you know hormone that um, will you know cause your body to um, store fat in your thighs, in your buttocks, and your tummy and your hips. So don't want to go there. And of course, xenoestrogens, the artificial estrogens that is found in lots of places. And um, it's, it's very bad for us. Um, so it causes high levels of estrogen, which is it puts your body in a, a fat storing mode. And that's not what you want when you're trying to maintain healthy weight, right? So those are the bombs. Boo. Okay. We've got that refined sugars and no stress and zero estrogens. Got it. Okay. So the next thing we want to do is raise our metabolism. So like I said, you want to burn more fat at rest um, than, you know, than normal because you want to get this metabolism really fired up. So get enough sleep. So we already talked about that. It's very important. Weight training is, is excellent because the more muscles you have, the more fat it burns because the muscles use a fat for energy as well. Um, slim and sassy blend. So drink it regularly because it helps with uh, appetite and it helps with insulin. So it's amazing for energy. Um, and then also uh, we have um, mixed intensity exercise. So if you have, um, you know, a very quick burst of uh sprint and then you slow down and do something else <clears throat> this actually helps your body keep that metabolism up okay because it's like the hunter gatherer kind of um you know metabolism and of course break down your meals so that your meals are you know are spread out throughout the day so you're grazing and it helps with the metabolism so five to six small meals a day is much better so here's like a little um, example um, you know, you have your supplements, you have meals, you have fruits, and then you have a drink of um, the, um, you know, slim and sassy water. Uh, and uh, you, you just keep doing that every few hours. So my husband actually has like a timer on his watch that tells him to eat every three hours. It just goes bing, just reminds him to eat. Okay, so that's another thing that we need to do. So we have some helps here. Um, so doTERRA has like some um, protein shakes. This is the trim shake, uh, the vegan. This is our favorite, this is the one we have at home. Um, the, they have vanilla and chocolate flavors too. Um, they're pretty good. Some people like them, but we like the vegan and that's our family's preference. Okay, but um, you can try it. It's actually got zero trans fat, um, have five grams of fiber. 125 calories per serving, 16 grams of protein. So it's, it's pretty awesome. And no sugars, of course. Um, it, is, it has uh, Accenture trim in there, which is like a herb that helps control your cortisol level. Because remember, I told you cortisol, um, you know, triggers that uh, um, chemical that you know, stores fat around the stomach, hips and thighs. So of course, it's a stress hormone. Um, so it helps reduce the stress and it helps increase your energy level, which is great. This is what we want. We have um, another help, which is the Mito to Max. So doTERRA produced Mito to Max to help um, with energy production, mitochondria, basically. That's what it stands for. Enhances stamina and helps with efficient uh, use of oxygen. Um, helps with the meta metabolic adaptation for diverse activities. So. That's awesome. I love it. When I travel, I take some Mito to Max and I'm just going and going. You don't have to take any of the stimulants or the Red Bulls or whatever people take because then, you know, you're going to pay for it later. It's sort of like borrowing from Peter to give, him, give to Paul or something like that. <laughs> okay. Um, and, you know, remember that you have your deep blue rubs, your deep blue polyphenols to help with the muscles and joints when you're trying to have a good workout Um uh, you know, program. You don't want to slow your progress down with the achy, sore body. So use these products. 
I like to use Aroma Touch and Deep Blue together because Aroma Touch is like the warm pack and the Deep Blue is like your cold pack, hot pack, cold pack. So you rub it on your muscles and help with the circulation and get back on that treadmill. Okay, so that's all for me today and that's our class. And our next class is going to be Women's Health and Hormones, Supporting Women of All Ages. Bye. See you later. Bye.